you wanna run away Why you gotta be afraid I wish I could make you stay Cause baby I love you Why you tryna break us up When I'm tryna build it up I wish I could make you stop Cause baby I love you Guess I'm gonna dance alone tonight I'm gonna miss your body Hey dear friends, welcome back to my channel. If you are new, welcome. For today's video, I am going to share you our small bathroom makeover with Dollar Tree organization so it's definitely budget friendly. We are not going to break any walls, we're just simply going to transform and make this little room pretty because as you see, it's undecorated and very plain. This is our only half bathroom downstairs so it does get a lot of views from us including occasional visitors that comes in our house so... I want to make this look a little more inviting and welcoming. So here my husband is installing this wall shelf that I ordered from Amazon. I really like this, it's made of wood and I think it really did match the color of the sink cabinet that we have in here. I wanted to put some shelf here because I wanted to use that as a little bit of storage and also put some display to make this room a little more interesting and pretty. So here I'm just cleaning all the dust that fell from my husband putting this up and also wiping the mirror. I already deep cleaned this bathroom before we start this process but it does get really dusty here really fast because my dog door is also in here. So we do have this plain oval mirror in front of me. It was such a big mirror at first. We were just gonna take that out and throw it away. I did bought a mirror to put up here but I decided to just keep this mirror because it was such a nice size mirror. There's really nothing wrong with it. It was just boring so I decided I'm just gonna give this a makeover. Make it look a little more interesting and also i am going to organize under the sink here because everything was just thrown in here when we move here and it's not functional at all i'm going to use some baskets that i pick up from the dollar tree to make this area a little bit more functional and organized i'm also gonna use some contact paper and put down here because i love contact paper and i feel like it just brightens up everything really fast and makes it look pretty so I'm going to do that. I pick up the contact paper from Target and it's one of my favorite design. If you haven't seen my Panther organization video from my old house, I used that on my shelves and I think it's so pretty. I will make sure to link that video in the description box below if you want to watch that next. I also put up this battery operated light that I pick up from the Dollar Tree. It's one of my favorite item from the Dollar Tree because that light is so bright with just two AA batteries. If you are new here to my channel, hello and welcome. I am so happy you're here. My name is Sel, I am a wife and a full-time working mommy of one sweet boy. I upload new video every single week about realistic cleaning motivation, satisfying home organization, and a little bit of mom life. I would really love it if you subscribe to my channel and join my YouTube family for more videos like this. And if you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for coming back and tuning in. I truly appreciate all your love and support. don't really have much under the sink it's pretty much just the cleaners that I use to clean here and yeah on the very right side I have some plastic bags that I use for trash bags and then I have some tank cleaner for the toilet I have some actual cleaners for the toilet and also I have some gloves here I use that every single time when I clean the toilet and then on the bottom of the shelf I have some backup toilet paper and on the other side I also have some feminine products and here I'm just labeling everything. I'm putting a label here for the toilet cleaner because my husband gets confused on what to use every time. So I try to label everything so that he also knows where to put everything back. And here I pick up this chalkboard circle label from walmart i think it was like a pack of 10 for like a couple dollars so i really like that i'm just gonna hang this on these baskets 
I really like these baskets that I pick up from the dollar store, guys. It's time to give this boring mirror a makeover. I am going to use this nautical rope and this jute cord that I pick up from the dollar store. I'm also going to use hot glue to stick this around the mirror to make this look like a frame. I did use the gorilla hot glue that I pick up from Walmart. It's like 70 pieces for like $5. I think it's all worth it. It's so much stickier than the other glue sticks that I've used before. Please let me know in the comments down below what do you think about this DIY mirror makeover that I did. I do plan on doing this in my master bathroom mirror as well but I'm still thinking about it. Let me know in the comments down below what do you think should I do this in my master bathroom. Everything that I use in this video, if I can find them online, I will link them in the description box below. But not everything is new. I didn't really spend a lot of money. It was like less than $50. The only thing that I really spend on is the shelf and this mason jar that I'm using for my cotton balls, some bandage and Q-tips because I use this a lot. So I really wanted to put this down here because every time I need this, I have to go all the way upstairs to get this. So it's so cool that I could have this here. I pick up those mason jars from Target before I use those for my fridge organization and those are just leftovers so I didn't really spend money for that. And then that get naked sign. I saw that from Amazon and I just kind of like copy it myself. I made it on my phone and print it. So I only spent for the frame that I have for a long time now. It was like $4 frame from Target. And this cactus sign I have this for a really long time in my old house so when we move here I don't really know where to put this but I really like it I don't know why but I have an obsession with cactus and succulents so those frames that I have on the side of the bathroom I picked those up from Hobby Lobby like I said everything that I use here if I can find them I will link them in the description box below so please be sure to check that out if you're interested to know I am so so happy how this bathroom turned out not just it's cute but I think it's more functional now too so please let me know in the comments down below what are your thoughts I would love to know and I do love talking to you so just drop your comments down below
You're crazy for saying I should slow down But maybe I'm escaping the love we found There's something about you, something about you I like About you I like I get too drunk and too scared and And almost left town But there's something about you Something about you I like About you I like I get too drunk and too scared and lie to you If only you knew I would die for you One of us, one of us Gotta say the obvious Nobody loves me better Nobody loves me better Gotta say the obvious Nobody loves me better yeah. I get too drunk and too scared I hope you find this video motivating and helpful. I hope I inspire you to get up and tackle your own project at home. And if I did, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up as it helps my channel. Comment down below and share this to your friend to inspire them as well. If you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe, it's totally free, and turn the notification bell on so you wouldn't miss any more of my future uploads. Thank you all so much for watching, I truly appreciate your time, and I will talk to you all again on my next video. Bye!